to give Abraham a son. Abraham and his wife Sarah were very old when their son Isaac was born. One day, God tested Abraham. He wanted to make sure that Abraham loved God most of all. Abraham, God said. Here I am, Abraham answered. Take your son Isaac to the mountain and give him to me as a sacrifice, God said. Abraham obeyed God. He got up early the next day and left with Isaac, two servants, and a donkey carrying supplies. They walked for three days before they got to the mountain where God wanted Abraham to make the sacrifice. Abraham asked his servants to stay with the donkey. We'll be back, he said. Then he and Isaac went up the mountain with the supplies for the sacrifice. Isaac saw that something was missing. My father, 
he said. Where is the lamb for the offering? Abraham answered, God himself will provide the lamb. When they got to the place God had directed them, Abraham built an altar and placed the wood on top. Then he put Isaac on top of the wood. Just as Abraham was about to sacrifice Isaac, the angel of the Lord called out, Abraham, Abraham. Abraham stopped. Here I am, he said. The angel of the Lord said, Do not lay a hand on the boy or do anything to him. For now I know that you fear God, since you have not withheld your only son from me. Abraham looked up and saw a ram trapped by its horns in the bushes. He offered the ram to God instead of Isaac. Abraham named the place, The Lord Will Provide. The angel of the Lord reminded Abraham that God would keep the covenant he made with Abraham. God again promised to bless Abraham, to make his family as numerous as all the stars in the sky and the sand on the seashores. God promised victory over Abraham's enemies and blessings to all the earth through Abraham's family. Abraham showed his love for God by being willing to sacrifice his son Isaac. God provided a ram instead. This is how God showed his love for us. He sent his son Jesus to die on the cross so that we could have eternal life through him.